Porter. Say hi. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, yeah? Porter is sitting on my replacement radio flyer wagon. They actually came through and sent it, and so now we just have to build it. So that's pretty awesome. It's this huge box, and it came pretty fast, so I'm really excited about that. And Porter is in his nice sweater, and Grayson in, is in his nice red colored t-shirt. He's watching the show right now because we just got back from seeing Santa. So every year I take the kids to go see Santa, and instead of paying ridiculous money at the mall Santa or whatever, we go for free and we go to Cabela's. So we went, I took some clips, so I'll input them here. Porter was, he was loving Santa at first. Like just looking at Santa, he knew like Santa says, ho, ho, ho. Gray was so pumped. He was jumping up and down. He was so, so excited. We get there and Porter's like hanging onto me for dear life. Grayson like walks right up to him, gives him a high five. And he's, he tells Santa he wants a sticker book for Christmas. So I hope Santa's bringing in that. And he was so excited and he sat right on Santa's lap and then when it came time to put Porter on, I put Porter on Santa's lap and he was not having it. As you can see in the pictures, I have, um, Cabela's is really nice. You can take as many pictures as you want on your phone and then they take a professional picture for you. They always put it in this nice little, um, I don't know what this is called, like a folder. And uh, so here's the picture of the boys. So classic, Porter was not having it and Grayson was just like, what is going on here? <laughs> but uh, so cute, good memories. So yeah, Porter was not about it. Grayson loved it and then they each got candy canes afterwards and they like that. Um, and then after we went and saw Santa, it was actually right by the mall here in Columbus. So we went to the mall and they have a cute little play place for kids right in the middle of the mall. So we took the kids to that because it was like right across the street. And I haven't taken the kids there since before Porter was born. So this was Porter's first time. Greg couldn't even remember because it's been that long because um, the last time I took P Grayson to that play place was right before COVID and everything shut down. So they opened it back up. They clean it regularly. Um, but we went and so they played and they had so much fun. We took pictures and video, so I'll input those here. Both boys had so much fun, and then now we're back. And so we've already had a very exciting morning. That's kind of the end of like our Christmas activities other than like Christmas day and opening presents and stuff. But I'm so glad we got that done. Um, there was quite a line to see Santa, but we made a reservation beforehand, so that was good. Did you go see Santa? What does Santa say? Ho, ho, ho. So it was super fun. And now we're just home chilling. It's almost nap time, thank goodness. So I'm gonna put the boys down for naps. And then this evening, I'm, are you ready for nap? Are you ready for night? 
And this evening, I'm gonna go and meet up with my mom and sisters and we're going to get our nails done. We usually do this every year um, around Christmas time and this year especially because we're going to Jamaica. So we're getting our nails, nails and toes done for Jamaica. And I'm so excited. Are you ready for nap time? What? Okay, let's go nap night. Okay, I'm gonna go put Porter down. He is exhausted. I'm hoping Grayson will take a nap too. We'll see, but yes, I'm so excited to get nails done. So maybe I'll record a little bit then um, if I get the chance. Do you guys go see Santa too? Do you take your kids? Do you pay for Santa? Do you go free at Cabela's? Let me know down below. I only got that one short clip of us at the nail salon. We were just busy like having fun and talking and it's kind of hard to film when like they're doing your nails. But we did go get our nails and our toes done. It was so fun. This was a new place. We had never tried it before. So we were kind of like iffy on whether it was gonna be good or not, but it was great. It was fast and it was really fun to be there with my mom and sister. So I did my nails. I don't know if you guys can see. I just got, there we go. I just got like a light pink, kind of plain. I usually like to do sparkles, but Anthony doesn't really like sparkles. So I just did sparkles on my toes. I can't really show you guys my toes, but they're like, well, I wanted it to be like just a darker pink color, but the nail polish that they ended up putting on my toes, I feel like it was not the one that I picked out because it ended up being like a red color. And I definitely did not pick red, but it was like too late when I noticed it, but whatever. But I did get sparkles on my toes, so it was fun. Sorry, Felix is like going crazy. I'm like, oh my gosh, what is he doing? He's like got the zoomies or something. Anyway, it was super fun. Everybody got their nails done. We all got like some shade of like pink or like neutral color. Um, everybody got sparkles. So it was really fun and we are ready for Jamaica. I am so, so excited. We are just counting down the days. Um, just a couple more days then we will be in paradise. I am stressing a little bit because you have to take a uh, COVID test to get to Jamaica and then obviously you have to take one to get back to the US. And I'm not I don't have COVID. I don't think I have COVID. Like I feel great. I feel healthy, but it just makes me so nervous because I just see so many people testing positive for COVID right now. The Omicron, whatever, however you pronounce that, it's spiking right now. And so it's just making me nervous. Like I am vaccinated, but that doesn't prevent you from like getting COVID. So I'm just nervous about it, but I'm sure everything will be okay. I'm just going to think like good vibes and Hopefully we all make it there. There's like 12 of us going, so it's like a lot of chance for somebody to turn up positive, but hopefully that doesn't happen and we all make it there in one piece. I'm so, so excited to go. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, let me know what color do you like to get your nails done? Do you go regularly to the nail salon? The last time I got my nails done was when I was a bridesmaid in my brother's wedding. I really only go for like special occasions. If I could, I would go like twice a week or however often you have to go, but it's so expensive. Like we just can't afford that. So maybe one day when we have more money, I'll go and do that. But for right now, I'll just do it for special events. But anyway, thank you so much for watching my video. Make sure to subscribe and like this video. Um, make sure to stay tuned. These next few days are going to be a whirlwind. It's going to be so busy. We've got Christmas Eve morning. We're basically doing Christmas here in Columbus. Then we're going to Toledo and doing Christmas with Anthony's family. And then it's off to Jamaica kid free. So I'm planning on vlogging a lot of it. Um, so definitely stay tuned because it's gonna be so, so much fun. You're not gonna wanna miss it. But anyway, I'm gonna go. I need to move the elf one more time. That's two more times I have to move the elf, but not too many more times. We have him here, I'll show you guys. So this is where we have the elf right now. Anthony came up with that one. I'm not really sure where I'm gonna put him tonight. I'm running out of spaces. I feel like every parent has that problem, like we're all, running out of spots like where the heck are we gonna put this off sorry i'm like the camera was at an angle but anyway i'm talking so much i'm just so excited for jamaica but anyway uh i'll see you guys later bye